friend's just been taken into Albion custody. So long as you don't cock up that badly, you'll be my favourite operative today. Could have told you that. It's gonna happen. No, let's actually get some work done. Don't want to loiter around here. politician will appreciate his S&M sessions on public display. Oh well, let's find out. Blackmail data is hereby leaked. Good to hear. Say that's adequate compensation. I'd say it's a thankless job, but someone just sent us a video link named thank you.mp4, so at least it's a one thank job. Show me. You have completed your first contract with 404, the dark web's first peer to peer hacktivist network. I am in the network, I get the contracts. That's all you need to know about me. I'm nobody. I'm an out. I'm also connected to your optic now, so let's see who you are. Hold on. Hmm. Are you a dead sec? Oh, this is fucking mint, this. Yeah. That's more like it. Fortune's smiling on us today, dead sec. The world is fucked. We can help each other set things right. I'm at Somerset House, staking out contracts. Come and find me. Let's talk. Waiters. Mm, I'm a little skeptical of our friendliness. Bagley, who was? Ah. I've run Nout's name and face through the usual databases and turned up nothing. Oh, Nout, right, just got that. Let us really think about this. We're on a side of caution. Is trusting this stranger worth whatever risk it may bring? Worth the risk, in my opinion. She seems like a real dead sec fan, and I'd certainly rather have her as a friend than an enemy. If she isn't with Zero Day, she might know who is. And if she is with Zero Day, it's probably a trap. Either way, we'll have new information. Agreed. Let's do it. 
The thing you're after is around here. Did you double bickers? What? Oh, him. Um, yeah. He thought I was trespassing. <laughs> I set him straight. Okay. Now, about that message I sent you. I might have been a little, uh, overexcited. Oh, shut up! 
I've been investigating a massive contract. Too massive for the plebs you use 404. This contract is different. Dangerous. Who is it? I will tell you. But first, I have to trust you. And you have to trust me, you know? So, I'm going to send you another 404 contract. Let's just get to know each other a little better. Where's your evidence that these targets deserve whatever retribution we bring them? Oh, there you go. Asking the right questions. Trust me. I do my research. I know every contract inside out and they're all part of the problem. London, the world, will be much better off with our help. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to move this twat before he gets his strength back. Laters! Not a trap. Sounds like we have a potential partnership with this mean, aggressive mystery woman. Give it a think and we'll discuss once you're out of Somerset House. Good plan. Unleash the full potential of your mind. Once you can be free forever. Sign up for our meeting today and join us. Thoughts? Bit on the obnoxious side, sure. But I don't get a zero day vibe from her. It's never a mistake to take the money, darling. <laughs> I say we keep going. If you decide to become gig economy hacktivists, then I'll support you, because I literally have no choice. Central recruit. Look like the type who might not like the current state of London. Are you with DeadSec? Or are you one of those villainous bastards trying to replace the royal family? Oh, uh, what? The takeover. They're trying to replace the royal family with lookalikes. The bastards want their puppets on the throne. They've infiltrated every power structure in London. Huh? Here. I've identified the ringleaders, their cronies, and where they operate. Go put an end to their nasty business. Prove that you're a real Brit. This is for Queen and Country. Right. I'll have a go. Well, they held my attention, I'll say that. Now, Bagley, a little help here? Oh, no, she's off her fucking lip for sure. Allegedly, her shadowy cabal is headquartered at a nearby Albion field office. Might be worth investigating regardless. All right, then. Let's get debunking. Novelty Christmas light. Shaped like a flag, but it's something. It is, it is something to cling to. Joining me, as always, is uh, Alice. And uh, Alice, hold the front page. Technology, apparently, is here to stay. There's no way around that now. Uh, much as I'd like to go back to the 18th century and see if we can have another crack at the Industrial Revolution and get it better on this time. But new tech 
is creating 4,000 jobs. Count them all, 4,000. 4,000 new jobs, thanks to this new tech investment. I mean, that's a very exciting thing if you're someone who wants to work in the tech sector, but I can only assume that this tech investment has created 4,000 jobs that will immediately be taken by robots. Even if they're not, there'll be jobs there. No one in their right safe mind. That's the project progress, I guess. And we have to embrace the way technology is taking over everything because maybe this is this is a ray of hope for us in this dark universe that technology will in fact render us all obsolete and we won't need humans at all. Because look at the bad things that are happening now. What is the common denominator behind all of them? I don't know, Andy. Tell me. All the bad things that are happening now, all the bad things that have ever happened, all involved human beings. They always involve whatever anything goes wrong from the very dawn of time. <laughs> And think of this, an automated Nigel Cash, surely a step up on the human Nigel Cash. You could even program it to have a tiny, tiny sliver of conscience. And if you had an automated Prime Minister, you could program it to be occasionally with other country. So that's, again, it's a step forward. Again, I insist that there's never been a Prime Minister. What have you got, Bagley? Some Albion guards posted here are selling pallets of high-tech weaponry to Clan Kelly at a healthy markup. I mean, sure, it's corrupt, but it hardly rises to the level of evil scheme. I think it's time to cause pain and destruction. There are the weapons. Dismantled the non existent conspiracy. Shall we let our friend know what we found? Your conspiracy was bollocks, but you did identify some very nasty fucks and we took them down. Oh, you sweet fool. 
They must have caught on to you and covered their tracks. I warned you. Oh, well, at least you set them back a bit. I knew you were trustworthy. Stupid, but trustworthy. You can go your own way, or you can join DedSec. What do you think? Right. Count me in. Having good people to fight alongside with makes this easier. Glad to have you. I must say, I'm rather looking forward to the experience. Let's go hunt some baddies. Brilliant. really beat all the competition? Well, it's really the data, isn't it? Ever since Broker hooked up with Bloom, that's when things changed. And really, that's not actually that great. Bloom has data on everybody. They collect information about everything you're doing. Listen, 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 listen. Just listen, listen, listen. Listen, 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 listen. Listen, listen, This calls for some redecoration. What's the point of risking your neck out there if you don't get any credit for it? Haste Ups let the people of London know that DedSec is back, and the increased visibility might even encourage some of them to donate to the cause. What a fuck up. Go on. I always said London could do with more decoration.
something the matter? Right. No. 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 Okay. You want something? Yeah. All right. Seems Albion has a surveillance network in Lambeth that makes 1980s East Germany look like present-day East Germany. I'm sure the people of Lambeth will be interested to know just how closely they are being watched. Shit in your eyes. You got beef with me. Oh. 